We wanted to change T-Mobile cybersecurity to provide better outcomes for our customers and do it fast. We faced a number of challenges from legacy technologies, disparate systems, needing to consolidate our security tooling to be able to deliver a more modern outcome. So we have multiple threats and multiple threat actors that we face every day, from those criminals who are targeting our individual consumers, right, through organized criminal networks that you hear about in the news, to potentially nation states and other adversaries who are trying to attack the critical infrastructure in the US. The migration to a modern SASE solution for us improved our security in a number of ways. First, it allowed us to consolidate this large attack surface of a number of VPNs down to one more modern system that is supported by our partner for us. We don't have to maintain and patch and service all these different systems. The second is just the scalability. When I want to deploy a more modern inspection capability, whether it be SSL offloading or DLP, that takes more compute, more resources and capability. And when I use a SASE solution, it's natively there for us. We began with ZIA, so the internet access filtering, taking the internet access and moving it to the cloud-based Zscaler proxy solution for SSL offloading, content filtering, DLP inspection. We were told that nine months was a aggressive but reasonable timeline to deploy ZIA. Being the uncarrier, we did it in three. It was also enabled by ZDX. ZDX gave us the ability to monitor performance as we migrated to Zscaler, so we could quickly spot issues and then address them proactively. The second phase of our journey was focused on ZPA, the VPN replacement. We've been able to consolidate about seven different VPN technologies into the Zscaler technology. So our users just log in once to Zscaler and they're connected to what they need to do their job and nothing more. In the last three months, we blocked malicious threats at T-Mobile and they got stopped at Zscaler and so we didn't have to respond to those because they just didn't happen.